ciliated columnar epithelium is composed of columnar cells bear cilia on the cuboidal or columnar cells on the free surface. These are useful to move particles of mucus in a specific direction over the epithelium. Mainly present in the inner surface of hollow organs like trachea, bronchi, genital ducts, brain ventricles and fallopian tubes. Glandular epithelium Some of the columnar or cuboidal cells which get specialized for secretions are called glandular epithelium. Glandular epithelium is of two types. One, unicellular, isolated glandular cells, globlet cells of the elementary canal. Two, multicellular, cluster of cells, salivary glands. On the basis of mode of pouring of their secretions, glands are divided into two categories. 1. Exocrine glands 2. Endocrine glands Exocrine glands Exocrine glands are ducted glands secretes mucus, saliva, earwax, oil, milk, digestive enzymes and other cell products released through ducts or tubes. Endocrine glands Endocrine glands are also called ductless glands, secretes hormones directly into the fluid, blood. B. Compound epithelium. It is made up of more than one layer of cells and which has a limited role in secretion and absorption.